Good morning. It is October 30th, 2019. Yesterday when Lyle and I were on our way home from school, we looked out and we saw this and we thought, what on earth? This is the park across the street from our house. I don't know what they are building, but Jeremy and I laughed and said, if it's going to be some sort of like field, especially since it's going to have a roof, it appears, or at least a fence. It's like, hey, they're building our future ministry site for us right here. Just kidding. But seriously, if they build something that's, you know, decent, we might be able to use it for ministry purposes. It would be pretty great. The city of San Jose is funding our future work. We're headed up to get the girls. They actually get out about the same time. Lila gets out early today. There's Toby. Come on, bud. But we decided to all go up together today. This was a cute little Christmas decoration that this store had put up. Decorated for Christmas. I don't know if you can see the wreaths. There's a snowman. And then there's a floor shop up here. Oh, the window's only half open. I'll see what I can see. And she's already got her Christmas decorations out. And they've been here. You just barely see. She's got some Christmas stuff now. So this morning I have been sewing up some things that I cut and I cut this uh, skirt and leggings the other day and I sewed up the first one and the first one came out a little snug and since I knew that this material did not have even as much stretch as that did I decided to add fun stripe down the side. So the sides of this one have a stripe and it's still got the leggings and those those are like attached here in the waistband. It's all one piece. And I think this came out super fun. I think it would be better in a better quality material. The quality of this material is not that great, but it was really good for like trying the, uh, the pattern out with. And I think that I'm going to be making like every skirt I ever make in the future of that can accommodate them with leggings underneath leggings or shorts either like shorts that you know that are shorter or i like this this is kind of fun with the leggings that show so this is stuff that i've been wanting in my wardrobe but like you go online and you look for it and it's like i don't know 40 50 bucks for a pair of uh, for a skirt with attached leggings which is crazy so anyways here's my version I also sewed up a couple skirts in the same exact material for the girls because they are lacking just plain skirts in their wardrobe. Like all their skirts have like flowers or butterflies or you know just crazy colors on them. So and I made them extra long because <laughs> the, the last time I did this it didn't work but what, what's good about that is they can fold the waistband down while, they're, while the skirts are long and then as they grow they can put the waistband up. And I also made Ellie a bow to match her pajamas for tomorrow because why not? And I was thought it was fun that I was even able to get the dog like right in the middle. I thought that was cute. So anyways, that's all the sewing I've been doing today. Next up, I think, will be some clothes for Elijah because he's got plenty of clothes that fit him, but he wears the same ones all the time and they're starting to get raggedy looking even though he hasn't grown them yet, outgrown them yet. Good morning. It is October 31st, 2019. It is Thursday. And we don't have school until um, 11.30 and 12.30, right? After lunch for Lila. So we're playing dress up. We finished school and getting their room clean. And now they can dress up in some fun costumes. And I'm 15 years. Yeah, this is the costume that my parents brought Lila for her birthday. And it looks super cute. And then I am working on a pair of pants for Elijah to see if they're going to fit him. Ellie does not like the sun, and there's no sun. But she's got her uh, new pajamas on that I made her, because today is pajama party day. They're going to watch a movie and eat popcorn, and they get to come in their pajamas and bring their stuffed animal. So we are headed to school now. You ready? Um, no. I'm, they're going to believe me that I have this. Oh, yeah. An ice cream narwhal. You ready? Yeah. All right, let's go. Check out that sky. Normally I can see mountains over there and I can't see hardly anything. Maybe a couple buildings down in the valley, but it is definitely dark and stormy and rainy. So 
We're on a little adventure since we don't have the car, but we haven't been out of the house for like a week. Me, not since I haven't left the house since last Saturday. Anyways, so we are, we've walked down from our house and we're gonna cross over and go over to the mall. Yeah, but we get to uh, Get some dinner, get some milk from the grocery store. And yeah, we could be crazy people and run across all that traffic, but why? This is much better. Well, we're about to cross on top. Somebody getting themselves a selfie <laughs> with the city. That's funny. So, uh, Lila wanted to wear her fancy Nancy crown. By the way, the kids do not know what day it is. I have not told them. What day? I don't. I'm gonna wait and see if you figure out what day it is. But it's no big deal. But I, I'm actually kind of kind of nice not having to worry about it. Tomorrow is the first day of November. But so what's today? Anyways, this is the shot I wanted. <laughs> Crossing the traffic. There's the El Rey, the mall. Kind of a cool shot, but anyways. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Well, sort of, anyways. They're starting to put Christmas decorations up. There's like bingo or something going on. There's a stand up there with a guy with a bunch of prizes. Everybody's excited. He just said, good luck. It's like mall bingo. So they've had a lot of bingo winners. I have never seen them all. This is full of people. My phone mall. All these people right here are playing this game. Pretty cool. Let me rephrase. When I say pretty cool, I mean it's cool that a whole bunch of people are doing something all at once. There's probably like, I don't know, 400, 500 people doing this at once. There's my camera. Now we're focused interesting they had to put the tree not in the center but shifted because of their giant flower lights and in the giant tree they were in competition with each other you must have just been putting it up hands off what on earth is this <laughs> yeah. i don't think so how funny is this <laughs> this is too funny. It's like a robot. You can drive. We're in the grocery store getting some groceries and Jeremy's checking out so I brought them over here to look at the toys. I have never seen this before. This is a full bathroom. She's got a toilet, she's got a shower, toilet. a sink, shampoo, toilet. a hair dryer. This is hilarious. And I went to buy Lila wants to come back and use her I'm money she's buy, been saving for the I cat. I need more than $15 to buy this. So when I put these on Elijah earlier to try them on him, his new pants I made him, he never took them off. Uh, he ended up wearing them for the rest of the day. I think he liked them and they fit pretty good. So those are nothing special, but I did cut out a, another pair with um, the stripe fabric and some bright orange and then this this pattern actually has some patches that go on the knees and on the legs and so I cut the patches out to make this time and also a matching shirt that I'm working on right now that I'm actually a good chunk of the way done with the shirt it's gonna have some an orange neckband and some orange sleeve cuffs when I'm done and I think this will be a cute little outfit for him and that's gonna be it for today and for this video